Are handheld radiograph units safe to use as dental professionals? And the answer is yes, if used correctly. Let's chat about ways to prevent scatter radiation when using these devices. There's a few key things you want to look for and do to make sure that you're staying safe in the op. First thing to know about is the backscatter shield. This is an important part of the handheld unit, like this FDA approved XTG from Digital Doc. I know this seems small, but research shows that with the geometry and angles of scatter radiation, you'll be safe by keeping the unit parallel at your mid torso level. Level. This is called the zone of significant occupancy to keep you safe from backscatter. You'll notice that the adjustable strap keeps the unit secured in the right spot and more ergonomic. You won't have to set it down every time you adjust the sensor, which reduces operator fatigue. Here are several helpful tips to make sure you're in the safe zone. Bring the patient to the level you need by moving the dental chair. If you have the unit tilted and you're standing to the side, you are in the scatter radiation zone. So to prevent this, keep it parallel at that mid torso. Have the unit within two inches of the target without actually touching their face. If you use XCP kits, use one with a short metal rod to get as close as possible. For bite mace, have your patient tilt their head towards their shoulder to get that positive 10 degree angulation instead of lifting your arms to make the angulation. For posterior PAs, have the patient tilt their head towards their shoulder. For maxillary anteriors, they should tilt their head down and look left or right. And for mandibular anterior teeth, tilt the head up. It might be helpful as well to have them rest their head on the headrest if needed. If the patient chair is in the way, you can have the patient swing their legs off the side of the chair towards you, or you may even choose to do the whole procedure with the patient in a different chair. It's tempting, but don't use your hand to ever hold the sensor during exposure. Your hand will be in the direct beam and outside of the safe zone. Handheld units have been studied and are safe in a dental setting. If you use them with proper positioning, there's no radiation exposure.